Good morning. How are you, old man? Well, I'm getting up here, trying to wake up. How are you, youngster? <laughs> I'm doing fine, objectively speaking, of course. Did you not sleep well last night? Well, I was checking my messages and talking to a friend late, but I got to bed around 11, and I just got up. What is it? Uh, eight eight o'clock? Got my eight hours. Yep. It doesn't help you to stay up that late, old man, or sleep in that late, not in tune with the Arcadian rhythms of our bodies. I'm in bed by 8.30, and I'm up at 4.30 a.m. I'm just getting to sleep by then. I don't sleep too well. And it's still dark at five in winter. The hell you do then? Well, no one will sleep well on that schedule. But we start by drinking a big glass of water. By 5 a.m., I make her a mocha java, I make Brenda breakfast, and then I prepare her lunch so she can get off to work. How are you feeling right now? Well, my bones are stiff. I'm in my 60s, you know. Not as limber as I used to be. It would help if you did stretches every morning and stop telling yourself stories about being old. I have good reason. Back in 07, I was pretty sick. I was unemployable, Raphael, and the doctors told me I'm hyperallergenic. That means I'm allergic to everything and hypoglycemic. And they had some other bad news for me, too. They told me, as we grow older... Stop, old man. We don't have to hang labels on ourselves or accept labels on ourselves. We can choose to heal ourselves. So stop telling yourself these stories because every cell in your body is listening to you. We can decide who we want to show up as. That is our choice. We can choose to heal ourselves. That's easy for you to say. I had no choice. The doctors told me I had this and that. At some point, you had something to do with getting ill. You or your higher self made that choice. Why would you choose that? Ask yourself, what is the payoff? What is it you're avoiding? <laughs> Wait till you reach my age, young fella. See how you feel then. I am older than you, my friend. I made this video after I shaved. But remember, you have to love yourself and care for yourself. Honor yourself. Be healthy and happy. Every body is different. And that's why we must test our own Intuition, not diets, and our body. Trust your body. Well, in that case, you're not me. So don't tell me how to behave. But I am you, old man. I just choose to be me. I choose to out hike and outwork friends half my age. I choose to exercise, to drink lots of well water. When we go sedentary, our bodies age quicker. I've decided to live a quality life for a long time. And remember, how we eat, how we think, is more important even than what we eat. Oh, well, if that's true, then why do I have to watch what I eat? You just said we can heal ourselves. Good point, old fella, good point. The obvious reason is that our capacity for anyone to heal themselves is fantastic, is amazing. We are more powerful and more beautiful than most humans ever imagined. But our potential to utilize that choice is very, very slim in present cultures. Therefore, it's a great idea to eat a whole food plant-based diet, not processed or chemicals, and drink lots of well water. Love yourself. Love your. Okay, okay. Well, I hear you, kid. I hear you. But why? Why should we go through all that pain of exercise and self-care? Life is much more beautiful and fun when you do. Think of life as a stretch. Don't dwell on, I have to stretch. Focus on how great you feel when you come out of the stretch. The end result is what you want. To be here now and to feel that. And the real purpose, old oh man, you know you and I have seen many, many places and things that most people who go through their life blind, will never experience in this lifetime. Our message, each and every one of us, is much more beautiful 
and more powerful than you may have ever allowed yourself to even imagine. In fact, you're manifesting everything in your life, in your thoughts, in your energy right now, every day. Well, why don't we move on? Why don't we choose the stretch? We have been taught three things in these cultures. A pill to make us feel better, something better to eat, and to be entertained, distracted from reality. Throw away your TVs and be present. Be here now. Life is here, but you don't see it. You're so busy trying to speed down the road to hurry up and wait somewhere else. Slow down. Look at the beautiful earth around you, the blue skies, the green mountains, the white clouds. Oh, not so beautiful anymore. All this industrialization. We used to be able to see them mountains 20 years ago. And they had trees on them. Trees. Oh, well, then let's go for a walk. Let's be kind to Mother Earth and the other species and seek God in every blade of grass. We are of the same energy. This we have seen. Fine. Sounds like a good start to me. I'm going for a walk. I'm out of here. See you later, old man. Not if I see you first, Raphael. <laughs>